The most rewarding part of my job is being able to really take some of the most immunocompromised patients and get them through a very difficult type of uh, treatment, but with the potential for a long-term remission. My name is Sagar Patel. I'm a physician at the Huntsman Cancer Institute in the Division of Hematology and Hematologic Malignancies in the Blood and Marrow Transplant Program. So I specialize in blood and marrow transplant as well as cellular therapies. So this involves using um, chemotherapy and or radiation to treat a variety of both uh, malignant and classical hematology disorders. So a common misconception about bone marrow transplants is that it involves surgery and or a painful operation to actually receive them. However, it actually is an infusion of stem cells. And these stem cells can come from either that particular patient, depending on the disease, or from a totally different person, a donor. Stem cells are really progenitor, early kind of mother cells that can then give rise to other types of cells that are essential for the human body to function. I was fortunate during my um, med internal medicine residency training to be able to do rotations on the bone marrow transplant unit. And at first, I wasn't really sure what to expect, but quickly learned that this was an incredible opportunity. I think the most rewarding part of my job is being able to really take some of the most immunocompromised patients on, on our campus and get them through a very difficult type of uh, treatment, but with the potential for a long-term remission. So in my uh, time off, I, I really enjoy both hiking and travel, and so I sometimes like to actually be able to combine those. And so I've been um, uh, fortunate enough to be able to, to go on a few trips um, and this, to other countries actually to, to do just that. So I've been to Iceland and Turkey. The attraction of, of some of these trips um, when I go is really just seeing uh, landscapes and geography that I, I couldn't even imagine. Former President Barack Obama, um, I think, you know, being able to make very complicated decisions, especially with information that you may be incomplete, um, and leading, you know, very complicated, diverse teams. Um, these are actually, you know, things that I, I do on a much smaller scale, and so I think that would be an incredibly valuable learning opportunity. And being able to also do that with sort of uh, grace and humility, um, especially as uh, in that sort of position, I think is incredible. When, when patients come here, in one of my sort of emphasis and, and focus on, on their care is, is to really make sure that every single piece and element of, of their care is, has been um, brought, brought to sort of full bear. And so this includes um, having a pathologist re-review their original biopsies, having radiologists re-review their PET scans from wherever they may have obtained them. And then when, when I evaluate a patient, I really want to bring in not only my expertise, but my entire division's expertise and reach out to the very expert that uh, writes those um, publications in that, for that particular disease. And so this way, patients get the most comprehensive level of care possible.